Hello everyone, I'm Simran Manglani from Team Bodhi Journal and today we are going to make 5 easy mini envelopes. The size of each envelope is the same and would be mentioned later in the video. I hope you love this DIY as much as I do. So let's start with the first one. You need a sheet of brown paper and size that paper into a square of side 10 cm. So for the first idea, we are basically using a rubber stamp to create a repetitive leaf pattern. Now we are going to make the envelope and for that I am folding the left and the right corners to meet the center. I made an insert for the envelope using an old book page and our envelope is ready. Let's start with the second idea. We will need watercolors for this one and I am taking a white cardstock sheet and cutting it in the same dimensions as the previous one. We are going to make a deep teal color using two parts of Prussian blue, one part of lemon yellow and one part of Viridian green. I am adding a little bit of Viridian green to the mixture again. I am taking a flat brush and we are going to wet the paper before we start painting our galaxy. We are using the wet on wet technique for it. That means that we will apply a new layer of paint while the previous layer is still wet. For this layer, I am adding a mixture of yellow and green paint. Our first side is done and we'll do the same for the second side as well. Now comes the favorite part, making stars with the splatter technique. Now we are going to make the envelope in the similar manner that we did for the previous one. Gypsophila flowers are so versatile that I had to include them. They are game changers and look at how they changed the look of the envelope in seconds. It's time for idea number 3. Take a coffee stained paper and convert it into an envelope. I'm using leftover journaling scraps to add a layer to the envelope. All the product names that are being displayed over in this video are available for purchase from our website and I'll also mention the links of them in the description box below. See, this was so easy to create. You can use this idea while sending letters to your pen pals. Let's move forward to our second last idea. This one is my favorite because you just need a white pen and a black sheet to execute this. Moreover, making repetitive flower patterns is so therapeutic for me that I can do it all day. You can even try this pattern with different color combinations. Let's hop on to our fifth idea. For this one, I've already created this envelope using a white cardstock sheet and now I'm giving it green gradient with the help of watercolors. Now I'm going to journal on it the same way we did earlier. With that, our fifth envelope idea is also done. We hope it was a fun experience for you all. If you enjoyed this video, do like, share and subscribe. Till then, bye!